In the world of stock trading, it's so easy to get overwhelmed and lost in the endless abyss of information that's out there. There's free ebooks, paid courses, and scammy YouTubers. Here in my garage, just bought this uh, knowledge. It's extremely hard to decipher what's good information and what's bad information. As someone who's had to go through the exact same scenario myself, I found it extremely annoying. So that's why I'm making this exact video. So you can cut out all the bull and get a complete a to Z guide on how to start trading stocks if you're a complete beginner. Now, I'm not gonna do the usual YouTuber approach where I wrap this all up in a nice little bow and make you pay $299 for my course. The best part of the series, it's completely free. 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 Now, after trading for around eight years, I can say there's a lot of information we have to swim through. My job is to go over that information in a simplistic and efficient way so you can understand the maximum amount of information possible in the shortest amount of time. That's the goal, at least. Now, there's a specific question I get asked almost every single day in the comment section from new traders. Trader after trader asking the same exact question. And that question is... How much money do I need to start trading? And my answer? My answer might just surprise you. Is it $100? <gasps> Is it $1,000? <gasps> Is it $10,000? My God. What if I told you the answer is $0? Let me explain. One of the biggest mistakes beginner traders make is they just instantly jump in the market with their life savings without any experience at all. Just because they saw some stock TikTok trader in front of a Lambo and thought, hey, that looks fun. Considering they have no experience, they lose all of their money, then end up saying, ah, maybe this isn't for me. Then end up quitting and never try to trade stocks again. I quit! And the sad part is, this is what happens to the majority of traders. What I'm about to tell you is how you can completely avoid that altogether so that doesn't happen to you. There are devices called trading simulators or paper trading, which is basically a platform where you can trade with fake money so you can test things out. Test different strategies, test your risk management techniques, test controlling your emotions, or maybe you want to test out different trading styles like shorting. Most new traders skip this step entirely, and honestly, it's the most crucial step out there to becoming a successful trader. That's why I'm listing it as my very first step. There are a lot of different trading simulators out there. Some are paid, some are free, but the one that I would recommend the most is Weeples just because it's free and they have a really user-friendly dashboard to where it's not really confusing and it's really easy to use. And I really like their name, Weeble. Weeble. Weeble, weeble, weeble. So that's what I would recommend if you want to try one out. Plus, I think they give you 12 free shares of stock or something like that if it's your first time signing up. So that's a good bonus as well. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to try out their trading simulator. No, this video is not sponsored by Weeble. I just recommend them if you don't have a trading simulator already. But Weeble, if you're watching this, <coughs> <clears throat> so what I would recommend doing is getting on Weeble, start paper trading, and just do what you would normally do if it was real money. But the trick is you have to act like this fake paper trading money is real. Act like it's your actual capital. Put the concepts that I'm about to teach you in this video series to the test. But not only that, take it a step further. Record every single trade you take. If it was a losing trade, write down what you think you did wrong. Did you get greedy? Did you move your stop loss? Did you let your emotions get the best of you did you follow your rule set record everything for every single trade the more the better this will exponentially speed up the process of you becoming a better trader but not only that you should record all your winning trades as well write down what you think you did right that way you can look back at it and try to repeat the concepts you did right when first starting out you should not be focused on the money aspect of trading at all you should purely be focusing on your trading strategy improving said strategy and trying to learn as much as possible. If you do all of this, the making money part will just come naturally. Doing just this one simple step will let you pass hundreds of thousands of new traders on the learning curve. This tip in itself is a game changer. I'm serious, every new trader should do it. That's my first step on how to start trading stocks as a complete beginner. I was thinking about making this a video series where we go completely from A to Z on how to become a successful trader. This is gonna include everything. Risk management, trading psychology, 
psychology, chart setups, market structure, candlestick patterns, trading strategies, everything. A to Z, beginning to end, everything you need to know as a beginner trader. If you guys are interested in something like this and you guys get this video to a thousand likes, I'll make this a complete series and do a total blueprint on how to start learning to trade stocks from a complete beginner.